What's up, everybody? My name is Jonathan. You guys are watching Sonic Speed, and today we're working on a Ford Transit, the Dura Torque, I think is what you call it, which is basically the diesel. As you can see here, we're changing the fuel filter. We're already draining it out. Um, you just twist that counterclockwise, and it comes out. It's got a clip. You just push that, and there you go. Pops out. <laughs> well, I'm just trying to show you guys how to do it. Um, so tools we'll need is the fuel filter, as you can see there's the fuel filter and gasket, there's the part number as well, and then we also have the um, fuel filter wrench, and then we're also using, as you guys saw, my panel popper right there, so obviously you gotta take that off, and then you just turn this counterclockwise, hang on a minute. Alright, so there you go. See it snap and then it turns just like another quarter turn after that and the whole thing comes out as one whole assembly. Um, so now we're going to go ahead and take this all the way out so we can go ahead and get it swapped out with the new field filter. So right here I started struggling a lot with trying to um, untwist the fuel filter from the housing. So I just skipped it so I wouldn't bore you guys. As you can see, it twists off. And voila! You'll see right here, I'm pulling off the fuel filter. I don't want to bore you guys with putting it on, but it, simply you just pull it off of there, uh, put the new one on, and then around it, um, around the side there, you can see the brown gasket, um, which will screw back into place. As you can see, we got it on. vehicle here and we're getting ready to put it back in um, so as you can see I already had it lined up into place here there's an arrow that actually guides you and then obviously you just twist it that little bit so it actually locks back into place where it should be as you can see I'm trying to get the, the tool off of it now and let me show you where the arrow is on the filter see it right there the point right there there's that one and then the one on the filter assembly itself um, so now I'm just trying to get the plastic push pin back in put the plastic harness connector back in and yeah I'm just pretty much doing the reverse process of what you didn't really see me do in the very beginning of the video um, I'm gonna go ahead and tighten back up the drain and as you can see, I for well, you're going to see I forgot to take off the fuel filter wrench, so I had to take that clip back off. But yeah, guys, pretty simple here. Um, and I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Try to make one quick because I'm super busy. I've been super busy, but thank you guys for watching. God bless. Stay safe.